Animators use a variety of tools for accurately enveloping characters. However, the models produced by these tools are often too slow for use in high-performance applications such as training simulations and video games. We propose a technique that can learn from a set of exported example poses and generate a fast and accurate model for high-speed evaluation. Our model is also much more expressive than linear blend skinning, currently the most common enveloping model for real-time applications. We tested our technique on a variety of examples, including muscle bulging, shoulder deformations, skin sliding, and twisting. We can accurately express joints with more than one degree of freedom, like the shoulder. Here we illustrate rotations along all three degrees of freedom. Whereas shoulders often cause problems for SSD, our result is almost indistinguishable from the ground truth. Our model can accurately approximate the deformations from human scan data. Here we demonstrate our technique blending between human scan poses. Our model can express large muscle bulges as well, such as at the knee of this leg, and roughly approximates skin sliding over bone. Here, we have no problems modeling the large arms and shoulders of the gorilla figure, while SSD causes collapsing artifacts. Our model even works well with this set of artist-generated extreme poses. There has been a rich body of prior work that has tried to address the deficiencies of SSD. Displacement interpolating techniques, such as pose space deformation, add corrective displacements to an existing SSD model, but generalize poorly for cases in which SSD cannot approximate the rotational deformations. Our model correctly captures the twisting present in both the bar and the elbow. Twisting motion is especially troublesome for SSD, requiring the displacement interpolation techniques to capture extreme corrective displacements. Because our model captures rotations much better, we complement existing displacement interpolation techniques by providing an alternative to SSD. Previous work has also inserted halfway joints to try to prevent blending of large rotations. Because this approach inserts these joints a priori, it does not always generalize well. For instance, consider an anatomically inspired arm rig in which the elbow both bends and twists. We compare our technique with that of Moore and Gleischer and SSD. The twisting motion is enough to impair the SSD prediction. Moore and Gleischer's technique does better, but there are still differences. Our result is almost indistinguishable from the ground truth. Finally, our model generalizes well to unseen poses. In this example, we show our model evaluated on a completely novel test sequence.